Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to solve an example on real numbers. There is a circular path around a sports field. Sonia takes 18 minutes to drive one round of the field, while Ravi takes 12 minutes for the same, that is to go round the field. Suppose they both start at the same point and at the same time and go in the same direction. After how many minutes will they meet again at the starting point? Now to explain this, let me use a figure. So here you can see that I have drawn the circular path and there is a sports field as it is given over here. The circular path is around the sports field. Since Sonia takes 18 minutes, it is represented by the bigger circle and Ravi takes 12 minutes, which is less than Sonia. So Ravi is given by the blue circle, which is smaller than the red circle. Now suppose they both start at the same point and at the same time. So if both start at this point and they are going around and they go in the same direction. So let us assume that they are going in the anti-clockwise direction. After how many minutes will they meet again? So logically thinking we can say that Ravi is going faster because he takes lesser minutes as compared to Sonia. So he will go one round the circle and he will come back to a point where Sonia is still traveling in the circular path. So we need to find out what is the time taken when Ravi moves once round the circle and comes back to a position where Sonia is still driving. So we need to find out that time. So to find that out, we are going to find the lowest common multiple of the timings given for Sonia and Ravi. So let me start by finding the LCM or lowest common multiple of 12 and 18. So this is a different method where we are going to find the LCM of the two numbers together. 12 and 18 go in the table of 2. This is prime factorization method. So we have to use prime factors only for dividing these two numbers. So 2 6 times gives us 12 and 2 9 times gives us 18. Next. 6 and 9 go in the table of 3. So 3 is also a prime number, so we are using it. 3 2 times gives us 6 and 3 3 times gives us 9. Now for the next division, 2 and 3 both are prime factors or prime numbers. So we are going to first consider 2. 2 1 times is 2 and 3 does not go in the table of 2, so we will keep the number 3 as it is. Finally, 3 is going to be in the table of 3. So 3 1 times and 3 1 times. So we have to repeatedly divide the numbers till we get 1 and 1 at the end of the division. Now LCM of these two numbers is nothing but multiplying the numbers we got in these repeated divisions. So we write it as 2 times 3 times 2 times 3 which is going to give us a number 36 or 36 minutes. That means Ravi and Sonia are going to meet at the same point after 36 minutes. I hope you have understood all the steps and liked the video. So if you are liking my videos, like, share and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.